call it a day. Hey guys, welcome to day one of the fashion series here on my channel. From today, today is Monday, all the way until Friday, I'm going to have new fashion hauls throughout this entire week. So I asked you guys for different stores, like stores that are your favorite, stores you've always wanted to try out, and I got a ton and a really long list, but I kind of narrowed it down to the top five. So the five most requested stores are the ones that I ended up purchasing from to show you guys some really awesome looks for the summer. So today's video is going to be all of American Eagle. I do have to say before I start this video, I had two bathing suits and I'm not going to try either one on, I don't think, because there's just no coverage there. There's nothing happening. Okay, so the first item is this swing tank. It was $14.99 and I got it an extra, extra large. I like it, it is really like airy and comfortable. It's white, so even like the smallest things show up. So I got like a piece of makeup or like just a little bit right there, um, but I'm sure it will come out easily because it is white. You can kind of see the bra peeking through. So I definitely want to wear a like t-shirt bra with this, but it is like really cool and just really, uh, I love it. It like basically feels like you're not wearing clothes. Um, the back is cute. I like the way that it dips down. It is a little big in the arms and that's the case with most shirts. Like that's always my problem is I always have a lot of room right here. So I could actually probably size down a little bit. And I usually wear like a 14 inch shirt. So I would say that American Eagle runs pretty true to size. So don't feel like you have to size up or anything like that. I shot there in high school back when I was like thinner. And so I don't know, I was kind of going off of that. I had no idea that they really even had a plus size line until like a few weeks ago. And as you can see, the bottom has kind of like this scalloped fray kind of material, which I think is really, really cute with shorts and even with some jeans, which are gonna be the next things that I show you guys. All right, so these jeans are the next thing I got. And I just wanna start by saying this top and these jeans are the first things that I tried in this haul. And I was like, oh my gosh, I love American Eagles clothes. These are so comfortable. I think it might be because there is so much distressing. I mean, the distressing comes all the way up to here. So it kind of feels like my legs have like room to breathe and move. Um, and I just, I love the wash. I think it's really pretty. Um, the distressing goes all the way to the ankles, as you guys can see down below. Um, so they're just like really trendy, really cute. Make the butt look good. And these were $49.95. Now, I don't think I would ever spend that much on jeans, but I did for this haul because <laughs> I wanted to show you guys. And then, as you can see, there's there's still some room here. They're very, very stretchy. So, um, yeah, they're the perfect pair of jeans. When you're a curvy person, I'm really, really impressed. While we're here with pants, I'm gonna show you these shorts. We'll just do all this section here. So sorry you can't see my face as I talk. I just love this like wash. I don't know what it is. It's got, it's like darker, but then it's got like some whiter spots, some distressing, um, super cute shorts. I absolutely love these. The only thing with these is that these are also a size 18, but they are much tighter around the stomach area. So I don't think they're as stretchy as the pants that I put on are definitely size up in these shorts, but I really do love how uh, high up they are, but they're like still very flattering. And I love the distressing. You guys know I love my distressing. By the way, if you see like the lighting, like changing, it's because my brother's back here doing some behind the scenes clips for a new project. So you guys will have to tune in for that. Also, I can't remember if I said it, but those shorts were $49.95. Okay, the next item are these jeggings. And once again, super stretchy really really comfortable i am impressed honestly i really am because so many clothing companies get it wrong when it comes to making jeans for curves they just do there's never really any stretch throughout here and i don't even have like bigger thighs like some other people might um you know i carry my weight in my stomach so for me th this these are a little tight right here in my stomach um so i might size up but I could definitely wear them. They're not like uncomfortable. Like it's not like unbearable or anything like that. Um, the color is really cute. I like it. And these were $39.95. So they were cheaper than the other two. 
if you're looking to get a good pair of jeggings. Okay, so with this next item, I liked the idea of it. I liked it on the model on the website, but I'm not sure how I feel about it on me. Um, it is very much, it's like very thick. It's a thicker material than I was expecting. Um, I mean, it's still not, you know, like winter type of material, but it is very, um, it's just thicker than I was expecting, really. Um, it is a V-neck shirt. It's kind of got this like watercolor marble kind of feel to it. Um, this does lace up right here. I don't think it's adjustable. No, so it's really just for looks. Um, it is a really pretty color. I love like this pinky mauve color. This is like one of my favorite colors on me which is why I gravitated toward this. Um, it is super soft though. I'll give American Eagle that. They were really, really soft. Everything fits so comfy and it just, you know, hugs you. Um, but yeah, it's just, it doesn't, I feel like it doesn't do anything to my shape. I think that's kind of my main problem with it. I just feel like it's just kind of like bleh. And this shirt was $24.95. All right, I really, really love this shirt. I love the color. I love how it's striped. It has so much character, and I'll bring the camera down in a second so you guys can see, um, but it does kind of rest right below my hips or right at my hip level, and I like that. The only thing I don't like about this is this. <laughs> so when you're big chested, you basically can never wear anything that has buttons or anything that's going on in the front here because it just like, it just doesn't stay there. I have tried so many times to wear like, button up shirts because I think they're super cute and I've always wanted to like pull it off but I can't because the shirt's always ripping open there so I don't feel like it's that noticeable but it's enough to make me not want to wear it on public. This back is my absolute favorite though. I just think it is so cute. I love how it crisscrosses and it kind of comes down a little bit. I think this back is so pretty. I want to wear it with these shorts. I'm just showing you guys. And I got this one in an extra large. I knew it'd be pretty stretchy. Most of these kinds of shirts are, and it is. Uh, so an extra large is great. And it was $29.95. All right, this next item, kind of funny. Uh, I didn't realize it when I ordered it online, but I'm pretty sure this is the dress that Brittany, Brittany and Baby, I'm pretty sure this is the dress she was wearing at Playlist when I met her for the first time. <laughs> I promise I didn't steal Britney's looks, you guys. I saw this dress and I guess we have the same good taste because I just think this dress is absolutely gorgeous. I'll pan it down in a second so you guys can see the bottom, um, but I really just wanted to show you the colors. I just love all the pastel, fun, beautiful colors. It has like this floral print on it. It's just a really, really beautiful dress. I did get it in an extra, extra large and it is pretty big on me. You can kind of see it in the back here. There's a lot of room right here, a lot of room. So I could have definitely gotten an extra large and maybe even a large, because sometimes with these kind of dresses, since they are so stretchy, there's no like form-fitting fabric, you can really size down. So maybe I could have gotten a large, but I definitely could have sized down to an extra large. There is a slit right here. I don't know if you guys can see that. There's a slit here. And there's also a slit on this side. I like how it adds that special flair. I'm literally swimming in this dress. I would have to wear heels with it. You guys can't see the bottom, but it's very, very long on me, but like, it's just so flowy and fun. Like you just want to dance in it and spin around. I love it. I really do love this dress, but it was $49.95. And considering that I feel like I'm like, just like it's huge on me. I probably am not going to keep it or I might just return it and get a size down because I do like these colors. Ah, the struggle. The struggle with clothes is they can look one way and like, and then you try them on, and it's too much fabric. That was so cheesy. I'm done. I'm done here. Okay. This next piece is a cover up, and I just have to say, this is the most unattractive thing I've ever tried on. <laughs> it's weird because it's a swim cover up, but it literally has two layers. Like I'm sweating right now on this cause it's like hot in my house. And it has like two layers of fabric. And I don't know, it's just something about the way that this is shaped. It's just not flattering. Not like I'm gonna wear this, you know, just as a regular outfit cause it's a swim cover up. But I would never even wear this 
in the summertime because it's so much fabric and it's so hot. The color's pretty. It's like this sandy kind of brownish color, which I like. Um, but I'll show you guys in a second. It's just, it's got like this tie on top, which, you know, is also cute, right? But this does nothing for me. I mean, it's just, it's not cute. To me, it's just not cute. The back kind of has like this lacy thing on the top, um, but the, you know, it's just like a regular kind of swim cover up. It's just, blah, it's like a paper bag. Like when I tried it out for the first time, I was like, this legitimately looks like a paper bag. I feel like I'm being way too critical over a swim cover up. Like calm down, Shaylee, I know. I'm just telling you guys, this would not be my choice for a swim cover up. I would get something lighter. I mean, most of the time I will just wear a sundress anyway when I'm trying to cover up my bathing suit uh, because then you could just take it off and then put it back on when you're done. And like who buys fancy swim cover-ups? I don't know. It was $34.95 and I just feel like that's a lot <laughs> for what this is offering. All right, you guys, this is just laughable. I do not understand this at all. Look how high these joggers come up. They literally could go all the way up to my boobs. Like, see this? This is how much fabric is in these. I don't understand. Why, are there, why is there so much fabric? But these are really big on me. I mean, there's just like so much fabric everywhere. I wouldn't wear these. I don't know, I've always wanted joggers. I've always thought it would be a fun thing to have. But after seeing these on me, I'm like, this is not flattering. I got these in extra, extra large. Maybe if I size down, they wouldn't look so huge and crazy on me. Or maybe this is just how they're supposed to look. I don't know, but it's not flattering. <laughs> so would not recommend, zero stars. But then again, not every body type is the same. So these might look bad on me, but good on you. <laughs> just saying. You can't win them all in these try on hauls, you guys. You just can't, especially when you're shopping in a new store you've never sized anything at before. So we're just playing a guessing game. And like I said earlier, the bathing suits that I ordered are just scandalous. Let's just say that there's no other way to put it. Like I would not wear them to the beach unless I was like alone with my husband on a deserted island <laughs> because I just felt like they covered nothing and they showed everything and I was not about to put that out there in front of the whole world. But I will still show them to you guys on camera. Um, they are both $24.97. I think they're on a sale. This is the first one. It's just like this red cutout. I love, love, love cutouts because I just think it looks really good when your sides kind of get shown off. The only thing with this is like there's literally no back, no back. So your entire back is exposed. It does come like right above the top of your butt, um, but this whole area is exposed and then your sides are exposed. And these cups on these bathing suits are terrible. Like there's no padding here and there's nothing holding the girls in, nothing. <laughs> so I guess if you're smaller chested, maybe these could work for you or maybe you can get this tied in a certain way i just could not figure it out and i just gave up i was like <laughs> we're not showing that one off and then this one is is definitely less revealing but this one has no cups so everything is see-through and i'm like is that what we're doing now at the beach are we not covering things Maybe this is a new trend that I have never heard of. I don't know. There was a little bit more support there with that one because of the halter, but yeah, being see-through. No, thank you. <laughs> all right, so that is all the clothes that I have today. In the comments below, let me know which piece was your favorite. And I hope that you guys are excited about this series as much as I am, because I am always looking for different stores and looking to try different things on and, and just seeing how like different brands work for body types. I know being plus size, not every brand is the same and it's always different and it's always changing too. So I hope that you guys found this video helpful and then don't forget to tune in tomorrow. I'll have a brand new video up with a different clothing company. Hope you guys have an amazing day. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you are new and uh, we will see you guys tomorrow.